Just a young girl with a quick fuse. I was uptight, wanna let loose. I was dreaming of bigger things and wanna leave my old life behind. Not a yes sir, not a follow up. And today I'm taking my son to the Center for Marine Education Aquarium. It's Monday through Friday, open 9 to 4, Saturdays open 10 to 5, close on Sundays and holidays. But the University of Georgia Marine Extension Service Center for Marine Education Aquarium. So that's where we're going today. Here we have uh, the seahorses. Aquarium. Nice seahorses. They must be new, I've never seen these here before. Got a little hermit crab back there. Horseshoe crabs. Horseshoe crabs. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Right there. Oh, Maybe I should pick up the other one. Maryland Diamondback Terrapin. Basically, uh, Maryland's mascot right there. Pinfish, mud minnows, and those are croakers. Pinfish. The ones that steal your bait all the time, right there. And they so go mullet, right there. Everybody's favorite in for bait, mullet. They go croaker right there. Crabs and fish. And they go some blue crab. Wow. Those are some big croakers right there. And they got a red. Fishes and crabs. And they go spot tail bass. We ate those before, we ate that before, we had crabs before, we ate everything in this tank before. What? Those are some big croakers. Whoa, those are big fish. Yep, the croakers. And that's a red fish. I didn't know croakers get that big. Wow. The crabs fighting. Why? I don't know. And you don't want them in this space. Well. Nice little spot tail. Caught these fish before. They're called Atlantic Moonfish. And these are the tasty northern puffers right there. And those are, they're called silver perch. Also known as yellow tails. Those are, it's still your bait in the water. Got a couple mullet in there. So puffer. And they have a I'm not sure what that is back there. Everybody's favorite fish. We got the snook right here. What? We got the speckled trout. What? And this guy a black drum blocked them away. And look at those nice old red fish. Just call them big fishes. No, that's a that's a uh, bull red back there. And that's a looks like a trout. But they're big and so huge. Yep, yeah, look at that speckled spotted sea trout. That's a big old spot, sea trout. Put in my pocket. You got a black drum. Making that noise, He's probably making that drumming noise. Looking for something to eat. Black drum? Is he a black drum? Yep. I don't see no sheep's head yet. But. Is he? Is he is a? Is that's a he snook. a drum? That's a snook. Wait. Right there, that's a snook. Snook. Right there, snook. Right there. Snook. Yep. Common snook. I just saw some huge fishes. It's fish, not fishes. This water is kind of murky, but it's there goes a robin fish. And some, uh, they got some striped bird fish coming up there. And this is a mullet. No, that's, what's that? Yeah, striped mullet right there. It looks like a sucker fish right over there. Funny lobster right there. Got the Atlantic spade fish. 
Wow. And we have the horn spine unicorn fish right there. Say and cheese. these I usually hang out with uh, sheep's head, I hang out spade fish. The trigger fish, pretty good eating. Ain't that right, buddy? Pretty good eating? You pretty good eating? Hmm? Yeah, and they're not shy at all. They go black bass right there. So you see they hang out at the bottom right there. And they get pretty big. So that's why I'm gonna go to deep sea charter for those big ones right there. They go gag grouper right over there. They don't get up my way. There's the gag grouper. And trigger fish won't get out my way. And a black bass. See two black drum back there. Here they come. He doesn't look like like he like the camera. Yeah, trying to videotape the black drum trigger fish keep getting in my way. Here go the black. God. All right, here go the black drum right there. Nice one. Yep, yeah, back there another black bass. So on to the next one. See what we got. I think that's about it. Lot Take a picture of fish. Here we have the lionfish. Lionfish. Okay. Does he? Red lionfish. It's an aquatic invasive species. Does he? What? Yeah, that means that uh, is he it's not a lion? To the ecosystem, and it could uh, cause e economic, human, health, or environmental harm. So these are hunt. I know these are hunted in Florida and gathered up. Cause they destroy the ecosystem. Here we have the plain head foul fish right there. We have uh, gray snappers in here and uh, tom tates and Atlantic spade fish and pig Ooh, fish. A so basically, all the bait snatchers are in this. Wow! A, a gold fish. No, it's a foul fish. A plain head foul fish. Man, I never seen a goldfish in the aquarium before. Some stingrays and some uh. Stingrays and fish. Fish, Atlantic stingrays. Uh, actually, I used a ball knife. Okay. Got the oyster toe. No, I don't see no oyster toes in there. But just catfish, stingrays. Yeah, you want to touch the seahorse? I mean the um, horseshoe crab? You go ahead and touch it. You touch it. Let me hold your camera. Um, hold, on. hold on. Hold on. That's it? Yeah, go ahead. Touch it. Pet him. You pet him. See? You want to touch it? Do you want to touch the um, horseshoe crab? Snapple? No, it's not going to snap you. Oh, they got horseshoes. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> This is a good place to bring the kids to, to play and touch the shells and they get familiar with the species in the savannah waters. Now, lift the shell up so you can help him with the shell. Tip his shell up so you can, you know. Yeah, just turn it up. Yeah, there you go. Nice. Oh, don't splash, bud. Hey, put your hands in. See? They're friendly. It's okay, look. See, horseshoe crabs are friendly. What? That's a uh, conch. Conch. Yeah, put a flip back over where you have I want to see what is this. I'll get you something you can eat it from the seafood place. Oh, no. All right, now put them back. 
Put them back over. The crab's in the shell. See? He's not camera shy at all. Sheephead bait, mussels, and a spider crab over there. Thank you.